Shepard, come on over. Hi. Hi. Sit down. Thanks. Like a little vino? Oh, thank you. The flies are thick out there. Yeah. A lot of flies. Ah. Ah. I did a flight picture once. Oh, really? Yeah, it was something about a nuclear accident at a, at a garbage dump. Oh, I tell you. Flies are tough to work with. Oh, I, I can imagine. Yeah. Not as bad as ants. Oh, ants crawling. Oh, yeah, those were the days. We uh, really tried to do something then. <laughs> yeah, anybody can hand a zombie a knife, but scare people with bugs, boy, that took a certain something. Something, huh? Shepard, I've got a bomb. A bomb? Oh, you mean zombie letterman? Yep, I've known it for a long time. This picture doesn't have any context, any flavor, any subtext. It has nothing. I mean, of course, a good script would have helped. I guess this means that you'd be shutting down and uh, leaving Crestridge? I mean, there's no need to throw any money down the drain. Right? Well, it's not that simple. They already sold this turkey to cable. I'm gonna have to make it work. Oh, I see. I could just come up with something like a... Maybe with werewolves or... Ghost. Ah. No, no. Mummies. Aliens. Oh. <laughs> aliens. Oh, I can't tell you how many losers I've had with aliens. What? I got it! I've got it! I've got it! I've got it! Ah. What, what, what is it? Oh, I'm sorry. You're gonna have to buy a ticket just like everyone else. <laughs> Well, gang, this is going to be the greatest action sequence ever done, ever. On our budget? On any budget. You want to listen to this? This is going to be the greatest ever. All right. Now, where do I start? Now, the zombie hijacks a dynamite truck. You like that so far? Oh, I love this. I love this. This is so good. Now, he goes headed toward the gym, and what do you think he has in mind? Leaving show business? <laughs> no. I'll tell you what he does. He rams into the gym during a basketball game and blows the whole thing up sky high. Ah, oh, the old zombie at the basketball game. I should have guessed that one. Uh-huh, uh-huh. Is that good? Now, he's speeding across the campus. Right. Meanwhile, a hero. He's on the motorcycle. He goes flying into space. There he goes. He lands in the truck, crawls into the cabin, and saves the day. Is that brilliant? I know, I know, I know, I know. I don't think I'd give that to you. Why not? I won't find anyone to do it. I can handle it. Hey. Pack it in, kid. It's impossible. You'll get killed. I can do it. I know I can. The stunt's yours, kid. I love you. I love you. I knew you could do it. You're listening to me. That's why. Now, here's what I have. No, I'm sorry. I, I just can't. No, no, no. You don't seem to understand. I... Oh, yes, yes, Monica is a very attractive and, and intelligent young lady, Mrs. Kraft. But I am not the one that you call about casting. I suggested... Uh, hello? Hello. Uh, excuse me, is this uh, Walter Shepard Productions? <laughs> it's getting to be. Hey, it could be the start of something really big for you, Shep. <laughs> That's what I'm worried about. You know, that is the fourth parent that has called me about getting their son or daughter into this picture. Yeah, well, how about helping me get somebody out of this picture? Who, Pete? Yeah, I'm afraid he's really going to hurt himself this time, Shep. Oh, I know. I just read the permits on the new stunt. Have you talked to him? I tried, but Trent's got him convinced that this stunt's going to make him famous. Well, what do you want me to do? Well, I figured uh, maybe you could talk to Trent. You know, I, it seemed like you guys have developed... Uh, a certain rapport? Well, I'm not sure that there's a shred of common sense behind those sunglasses of his, but uh, I'll try. Thanks. Mm -hmm. And uh, hang in there. <laughs> Hello? Ah, oh, yes, Mrs. Alberg. Mm-hmm. 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 Yes. Uh -huh. Well, um, you see, I'm not the one that you should call about, uh, uh, casting.
him tight? Yeah, thanks. Okay. Brady, Laura. What this stunt wants to be is to be allowed to express his own potential. Mm -hmm. I mean, uh, Mr. McAllister. Oh, Shepard, nice seeing you. If I'm saying what this stunt needs, it needs uh, Mr. to. Mr. McAllister. It needs to have. Uh, please, I must speak with you about Pete Johnson. Excuse me. Uh, give me a minute, okay? Right. Uh, what about Pete? He is the cornerstone of my plan. I know. Now, that's the problem. Uh, I don't know what you're talking about. Hey, wait, do you see the stunt I've created for him? <sighs> I'd rather not. Frankly, I wish nobody did. Please, this stunt is going to make my picture. Yes, but I don't think it's worth risking Pete's life. I mean, the odds against two vehicles traveling at high speed and coming together safely in the manner that you propose, it's astronomical. Mm, well, let me elucidate. Stuntmen are highly trained professionals that minimize every risk yes, by taking but, every... But I don't think that Pete is experienced enough to minimize that risk. Ah, but he has desire and talent and, most of all, 